Welcome. This video will show details on how to navigate within the ADHS licensing portal. To begin, log into the licensing portal. Once logged in, you will notice that the person icon appears in the top right. Click the person icon to view profile information. Click the pencil icon to edit certain information. Notice that the only fields that are editable are the fields that appear with the red asterisks. If any information is changed, click the red check mark to save changes. To change your password from within the portal, click the Change Password button. Click anywhere outside of the profile box to return to the Select a Portal screen. Two options appear for portal selection, the individual portal and the facility portal. For childcare licensing purposes, use the facility portal tile to locate all relevant information related to a facility. Click the tile to proceed. Next, select the desired program. The ADHS facility licensing portal page will appear. It is customized according to the types of facilities related to the user who is logged in. Users may see the Centers tile, the Group Homes tile, or both tiles. We will come back to these tiles in a moment. Below, we have the Other Facility Information section that all users will see. Click the Application Status tile to view the application history. Click the Child Care Forms tile to view any forms that may be needed to complete applications or other information. In the Applications section, Click the Initial Child Care Group Home application or Initial Child Care Center application to view and complete the initial applications. Click on the Centers or Group Homes tiles to select the appropriate facility. Select the appropriate facility tile to view the related information. Select the bell icon located on the top right corner for notifications regarding applications and other items. Please note that the tabs on the left may vary based on the specified access users have to the portal. The Facility Details page contains much of the information related to a facility. Click the Edit Information button for the ability to edit some of the information related to this facility. Please note the text in the top section informing users that a change or information update application will need to be submitted if a user would like to edit other information not available for edit on this page. Click the Certificates tab to view the related facility certificates. Clicking on a certificate tile will generate a downloadable PDF of the certificate. Next, the Applications tab will show any relevant facility applications. The Application History tab will show related application history. Use the options at the top to sort and filter as needed. The Facility Access tab will show all users with access to the facility. The user's access levels will also appear. Refer to the video on how to assign a delegated access user for more information. The Inspections and Enforcements tabs will show all inspections and enforcements related to the facility. Refer to the various videos on inspections and enforcements for more information. Finally, the Statements and Payments tab can be used to view related invoices and make payments for a facility. Refer to the video on Statements and Payments for more information. To log out of the ADHS licensing portal, click the Profile icon and select Log Out. This has been an overview on navigation within the ADHS licensing portal. Thank you.